Oh, baby. Hope you're doing well. We are in Madden. I officially ended my 10 hours a couple, uh, maybe yesterday, I think. And I'm in again. I guess they opened it up uh, because a lot of people weren't getting their 10 hours. So they open it up to everyone. You can also do the New Zealand trick. It's going to let you get access to the game early because New Zealand technically already has it out since they're a day ahead of us. I just logged in. I was in. I didn't have to change anything. So we're going to open a bundle, baby. Strap in. Let's get it. <laughs> What it do, YouTube? It's your boy, Sir and we're back with another Madden NFL video, and today we're going to open a bundle. We're going to be opening up the Platinum Elite Bundle, arguably probably one of the best bundles in the game as of right now, if not ever in Madden, potentially, just because of the fact you get eight Platinum cards. That's guaranteed eight coin cards that you can get out of here. You can get up to 888 overall players as well, coin-wise. I mean, the odds of that happening are slim to none, but it's still possible. We're also going to open up the weekly fantasy pack. I personally did not have any luck under the weekly fantasy pack. Last time I did it, the last time I did the elite player bundle, I actually pulled uh, 87 Tyree kill. Go check that video out. It was actually pretty wild. So we're going to do both of these, man. Before we get into it, if you don't mind leaving a like, sub, comment, all that good stuff, growing a little bit every day. If you like the video, make sure you like the video. Comment down below as well. If you've pulled packs, what's your highest pull so far and how you like it, man? 22. 98% of you guys don't sub and it helps your boy out a lot. If you consider it, hit that subscribe button. It's free to you. Don't have to pay a thing for it. And it helps your boy out greatly. You can also follow my socials below. I have TikTok, Twitter, as well as Twitch. Follow me on Twitch. Follow me on TikTok. Follow me on, follow me on all that stuff, man. We're going to open the bundle. We're going to jump into it. Let's start with the weekly one. I feel like the weekly is just not good. Personally, for me, I just never have amazing luck with this. So, okay. Cool. It looked like it went straight to the binder. That's okay. We're going to start leveling up, man. Madden is officially live and well, so I am excited. Here's our elite card, which is going to be 80 Dwayne Brown. No different animation between low and high. 83 Lamar, which could be interesting. Coin card. Give me an 88. 84 Harrison Smith. Not bad of a card. That's actually a pretty decent safe card, too, if you want to rent it out, hold on to them, and use them, and then you have coins to quick sell in the future. I'm personally doing that. I have Alexander currently, the 87, as a coin card that I'm using on my team. And I'm probably going to use him for quite some time until, one, a better cornerback comes out, or two, his price tanks below what his quick sell value is for. Let's open up this bundle. I'm super excited to do this. I was thinking about doing the gridiron, but I feel personally like gridiron's probably not going to be that great. So we'll do this one. Let's start out with the platinum cards first. There's no different animation, so we don't know what we're going to get. Anything helps right now. You got to rack up those coins. Okay. 83 Joe Petonio. I actually is probably going to hold on to that card too, or rental more than likely, as we're going to get 80 Jace Myers. I'll probably quick sell him. I'm probably just going to quick sell him right now. So just take the coins out. But Joe Petonio, I'm definitely going to hold on to. He'll be my left guard and I will quick sell him whenever I need coins. I'm not in desperate need of coins. I have a lot of stuff to sell right now. And I'm probably going to start working on selling a lot of the golds that I have, a lot of the rookie cards that I have, uh, because the game's pretty much out at this point. Uh, 80 Kenny Galladay, again, probably just going to quick sell him. No need for Kenny Galladay on my team. I got Randy Moss, Lance Allworth, so it is what it is. Justin Jefferson, interesting. He might be an option that can be there. DK is another good wide receiver that is a little bit lower that you can actually do very, very good with. Jamal Adams, very, very good. Another one that maybe I might have as a rental, uh, especially if he gets a card upgrade, which I feel like Jamal Adams probably will pretty early in the game. I'm hoping for like at least an 85 plus out of one of these, just one. We're going to get... 83 Josh Jacobs. I'm getting a lot of 83s, which is better than a lot of 80s. We'll take that. We should have one more after this one, and that's going to be it. We're going to get 80 Robbie Gold. I will more than likely quick sell him. Last one of the bunch. I have yet to get like an 87 plus coin quick sell. 84 Cameron Hayward. Okay, not too bad. That's a lot of coins there. We probably made about 200K just off that. This is where we start making our money, man. Uh, if you didn't, like I said, check out the last video I did the bundle with. Pulled 87 Tyreek, 80 Baker Mayfield. It was absolutely insane. It was like my second pack in. Uh, gold, gold, gold. Again, check all these prices for these gold cards because a lot of these go for a decent amount, especially that theme teams are pretty important this year. Come on, baby. Just one power up. We'll take power ups. Okay, Tyron Smith. A, a lot of the guards are really, really good. 81 Casey Hayward. Nothing, nothing. And okay, not okay. No, I was going to actually say that's good, but and we'll take it, but it's actually not that good. Back end bangers, 83 Kendall Fuller. We get a gold there. Rookie card. Okay, 66 and another gold. Okay, not exciting yet. I'm hoping this bundle turns up. At least we get like 187 plus, but I don't know. We got really lucky with the Tyreek and I feel like that's the best it's going to get. 82 Derwin, another good, decent card. Core rookie, 76. Price 
has has value three four thousand coins has value and we'll see if those cards actually hold value so 81 joe mixon nothing gold silver gold yikes come on baby there's our elite card okay dude nothing two elites love to see it 85 dalvin cook i've actually been using dalvin cook on the squad and he's very very good so i probably am gonna i'm gonna probably hang on to one of them and sell one of them nothing 73 71 here's our elite card 88 80 kenny more eight more okay for some reason i thought we only had a couple left we'll take eight more i just want like one at least 87 plus this could be big come on 80 carl we'll take that man i'll take an elite coin card out of my elite player pack give me another elite no we'll take that again i'm just gonna quick sell him right away because he's not gonna be on my team i'm gonna be shooting for right in of course aaron donald chase young a lot of those people especially that have speed on the outside a lot of good cards in this game this year so i'm excited to use them 78 cam acres 66 nothing our elite card is gonna be 80 jonathan taylor mm, yikes just one nothing oh could be good 81 oh dude i am not having good luck right now 67 there's our elite card is gonna be 80 tj hawkinson nothing and nothing no 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 no. i feel like these packs aren't as good anymore i feel like they're not as good anymore i swear like like first day packs are always so good because we don't know what the odds are i feel like as it goes on is when they start getting a little bit tighter 81 power up though could be good fletcher cox pretty decent pretty decent power up Fletcher Cox, I'm probably going to have on my team, so I might keep that power-up card, but we don't know what legends are coming. Uh, Josh Lambeau, okay. Not bad. Nothing. No, dude, I think I only have like three more. Three more, and that's it. Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm pretty happy with it. We probably made like half a mil, right? I don't know what the market looks like right now, but we'll see. Uh, Just kickers and punters I'm pulling today. Nothing. Nothing, dude. I think we should have two more. Come on, man. Walk off. Back end banger. Give me one. Give me one. This is actually our last one, too. Just one big pull. Nothing. This is it. 81 Limbal Joseph. Okay, let's go take a look at the binder. All right, so here's a binder. Nothing too spectacular that we got out of our, our bundle at all. This actually wasn't a good, a good bundle whatsoever. But, I mean, we're going to make some coins out of it. Uh, Dalvin Cook still has a little bit of value, I think. 44,000. I will take 44,000 for him. Again, I'm going to start selling a lot of these cards today because... Uh, the game's going to be fully coming out once more people start playing it then the market is going to slowly start going down plus saquon's getting the car very very soon we'll put him up for 43.5 uh, i'm gonna try to get to at least over a million coins uh, by the end of this and i gotta finally start no money spent so i'm excited to do that i kind of like more no money spent a little bit more than um like spending money because it's a little bit more of a grind it's, it's more fun to do um kicker i'm not going to use josh jacobs i'm not going to use justin jefferson maybe kenny galladay no Harrison Smith, Joe Batonio, I might keep them. Cameron Hayward, I might keep as well for right now. I don't think I'm going to use Cameron Hayward, actually. We'll take 121,000. Not too bad. I mean, wasn't the most star-studded of them, but we'll sell a lot of the stuff and make some sense. If you like the video, make sure you like the video, and don't forget to sub on the way out, man. It helps me out a lot, and I hope you guys enjoy the content. Stay happy, sell the guys. Tell your mama, tell your daddy. Catch you guys on next video.